Hello everyone, I'm back with another Track Mall Cake High video. Today I'll be ranking all forms worst to best. At number eight, we have what might surprise you is Ultra Instinct. Now, this form itself, cool design, whatever, but it it hasn't been fully finished, and the only thing it has is just instinctive dodges, which only which only like blocks one thing. It's a. Uh, it's around the power of Super Saiyan Blue and or around there, and I don't really like it in my opinion. And at number seven, we have what might even more surprise you is True Master of Ultra Instinct. Now hear me out. This was used to be the best form in the game, but nope. Uh, it was a nerf pretty hard in the UI update because. The instinctive dodges got mixed up with the, uh, with the normal UI. Thing is with this, it, it's the same multiplier as Ultra Instinct, but it has this one really weak attack, uh, Reversal Red, but it's pretty bad. And if this wasn't nerfed, it would definitely be at number one. At number six, we have Super Saiyan. Now, I would. Now, the update is coming in like a week, and Super Saiyan gets tons of new moves that I won't reveal. But, um. You can go watch it on Kiwi LR's channel. Uh. Some leaks he has. But here we have some standard attacks. Angry Command Man, just. It's. Not very good. I mean, it can definitely take it out a lot of health, but that's pretty much it. And the normal Super Command Man, it's decent, does its job. Uh, but yeah, it's okay. And at number five, we have it's pretty obvious Super Saiyan 2. It's literally just. Now, I would put this at number 6 because of the Super Saiyan update coming in a bit, but it's literally the same thing, but with double the amount of multiplier and, and a better charge. And I'm pretty sure we're just going up the forms now, but at number 4, to be honest, it's probably... Super Saiyan Blue, uh, Universal. Now, I was wrong about this in my top three best forms. It's, I, it's, it, it's really tanky. It's the tankiest of all forms of the game. But the only thing you can do is just M1s and P blasts because no, nothing works on this. And for some reason, it still drains my key. But, and at number Free is pretty easily Super Saiyan God. Now, hear me out. There's only like one rush move in the game, but like all God Command Kamehameha's are really overpowered, and they can just jump over it. Like, and it, it's pretty nice. And at number two, might be surprising. Super Saiyan Blue Limitless. Uh, it's a good form out of raw power. It's the strongest form in game in terms of power level. But the thing it lacks most is just the amount of damage you can do. Like, I mean, you can't combo very well. It's just M1, M1. Then probably like Limitless Command Man, which, which you can... It's pretty broken, you could just like step out of it. So, but it's still a really good form, worth grinding for. Um, and number one, it's easy. I ride this all the time. One of the best form, well, the best form of the game. Um, definitely Super Saiyan Blue. Now, you have a Command Man that actually works. You have a ability that gives you all of your health back. 
for like only 1,000 key, which is our Imperial Power. You already have a good G move, and you also have Kaioken. I'm pretty sure it was already buffed, where you could actually just wherever Burst Kamehameha, it's it's okay. It, and Perfect Transmission, which is really cracked. And those are this is a technique. I don't rank it above Super Saiyan Blue because Super Saiyan Blue is just better in my opinion. But Super Saiyan Blue number one, it's really good. So please subscribe. I need monetization because I'm really broke. Thank you.